again, children. Welcome to a special sing-along with our favorite sweetheart, the Ice Cream Man. Can you sing along with the Ice Cream Man? Let's find out. Hi! Wanna sing along with me? Good! Look at that. What do you think? New mascot will get the kids' attention, huh? <laughs> Bob Bats. I know. I know what you did with the dog. What? The dog part. I don't understand. Don't play games with me, Mark. I told you to knock it off, but you did it anyway. Arthur, I, I think there's some sort of misunderstanding. Don't act stupid, Mark. The thing nearly killed me last night. Arthur, I told you it got hit by a car. And whose car did it hit? Whose car has a stain on its bumper? Arthur, please, the dog needs nothing. Besides, I won't have to deal with it pissing on my shoe. We're telling it to stop barking or keep it going away from my work. So that's why you did it. You think that killing it and turning it into one of those monstrosities that I said would be a bad idea is the way to fix it. Arthur, it listens to me now. It does what I say and proves the obedience of what I've been working on. Oh, Mark. I wish you had gone down this path. But it's going to be okay. Your work, along with you, has only proven that you are dangerous. But the family, nor I, will have to be in the way of it. What are you saying? I'm taking the what? Maureen and I will watch over them until you sort yourself out. I've already spoken with her. Her, the kids, and I. We're leaving tomorrow morning. I know. I knew what was going on between you two. What? It's not like that. Well, no, it's fine. I fixed that little problem. What do you mean, you? No. Oh, Mark. What have you done? First the dog would listen to me, then my wife. I think the only thing I've learned through all of this is that I am not going to let anyone let me down, including you! Keep the flow going. Do you know the ice cream man, the ice cream man, the ice cream man? Who loves to eat his sweets? <laughs> 